What is up, people, and welcome to Video Game XD Reviews. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the Light Up LED Bluetooth speaker from Sylvania, I believe it's called. That's what the box looks like. Now, this is like a basically a portable boom box, as I like to call it. It's not quite as loud as a boombox, but it's it's decent. Um, here's all the stuff on the side. It says specifications: Bluetooth streaming. Use your mobile device to stream music wirelessly up to 30 feet via Bluetooth. Um, light up LED speaker, so it lights up. It looks pretty cool in the blue. Output power 3WX2, speaker unit 3 inches X2, bass, volume control, DC input for battery recharging, 3.5 millimeter aux in jack for MP3 player, internal rechargeable battery so you can take this wirelessly, uh, accessories USB cable. I picked this up at a retail price at Family Dollar, I believe I got it. Yeah, Family Dollar for $24.99, $25. Now, that's not that bad of a price for a portable boombox speaker, you know. This is not a CD player. You can't play CDs unless you have a CD, a portable CD player. You can plug an aux cord into that, into this. Then, yes, it will work. But this is mainly for... Um, modern stuff like listening to your mp3 off your ipod or if you have a cell phone youtube music you know anything with a, that can plug in an aux cord in and out you can use that for this and that's why i bought it because i never really owned one of these back in my day i used like portable uh cassette players and cd players and stuff like that Never really own anything wirelessly that recharged like this. So I thought it was cool. I picked it up for $25. Bucks. Um, let's take a look at the actual hardware, though. Okay, basically, this is what it looks like. Lights up blue. Pretty cool. And you can put it on its side like this if you want. So it takes up less room. <laughs> I ha have my auxiliary cord in. But the cord it came with is a joke. Okay? It came with this tiny ass aux cord. Like, look how cheap, flimsy, and short this cord is. This is a joke. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> and you get this... You don't even get the power adapter with this. I have my own power adapter. But you get this tiny little micro USB cable. Like, it is tiny. And it feels cheap, and it, they suck. But you're going to have to rebuy one of those if you want a good one. But anyways, um, yeah. I mean, it's pretty loud. It's not. It's got a bass. got some good bass to it, but it's not like... It doesn't feel like a real boombox. It just for twenty five bucks though. I mean, it's not bad, but it's not like amazing either. Um, let's play a song. See how loud this damn thing is. Shut this shit down like it's martial law. I'm really killing shit. Boss can go a hundred blocks. I bang triloquist cause I can make the money talk. Perfectly crafted, which crap which is baffling. Lock down the hatches, upstanding on scaffolding. Sharp as a hatchet, just Okay, I don't want to get flags for any fucking music. <laughs> cause it's YouTube, you know how they are. But uh yeah. It's loud, it's just not like the loudest thing I've ever heard. But it's it's decent for the price. Yeah, pretty cool, you guys. Um, right here is the source, so if you want to go Bluetooth, that button right there will connect it to a Bluetooth device. Um, you got fast forward to re rewind, skip, you know. You got the bass up here. Volume control. Up here you got the power button. 
USB in, aux in. That's pretty much it, you guys. I mean, 25 bucks at Family Dollar. I'm sure you can find it maybe at Walmart, too, or other stores. Would I recommend this? Would Video Game XD Charles Reed recommend this? Uh, I guess, like, if you're on a super budget and you want something decent, you, portable, rechargeable, plug in an aux cord... 25 bucks, I guess I would recommend it, if you're on a budget. If you got a little bit more money, like at least maybe 20 more dollars, 30 more dollars, spend like 50, 60 bucks on something else, I'm sure you'll get better sound quality out of something. So if you're on a budget, I recommend it. If you're, if you got money to blow and spend, then no, I don't recommend this. This is, it's too cheap. Um, it just, it doesn't, I don't know how to explain this one. It's just not very, um, the sound quality is, it's good, but it's not great. If I had to rate it, maybe a 6 out of 10, 6 out of 10, the speaker. Wish I would have got something a little bit more pricey, maybe like a 8 out of 10 speaker, but it's whatever. I got it at Family Dollar, so 25 bucks. Um, but yeah, this was Video Game XD Reviews. I will see you guys next time, right here on Video Game XD. See ya.